Hi guys and welcome to my channel at home with Shell. So today's video is a Primark haul and I'm super excited to show you all what I got. I went shopping to Primark yesterday with my eldest daughter and they've got all of their autumn stuff in and it is actually fantastic in there. Between us we spent £257 which for Primark is quite a lot of money. So yeah without further ado I'll show you what we picked up. If you're new to my channel, I would love for you to subscribe. I post two videos a week on things like fashion, lifestyle, motherhood, cleaning videos. So if that's the type of thing that you like, then I'd love for you to subscribe. The first thing I wanted to talk to you about is jeans. Now, I've never actually bought jeans from Primark before. I've always been a Topshop girl, but the jeans that I've bought in there are actually amazing. And I don't know why I've never bought them before because they are super cheap and I can't tell the difference between the Primark ones and my Topshop ones, so I don't know why I've been spending £40 on Topshop jeans for all this time when they seem exactly the same. So the first ones I wanted to show you are something that I've never ever tried before and another reason why I don't really want to spend a lot of money on them is the mom style jeans. So I've always been a massive lover of skinny jeans and I've never really thought that these suited me at all so I picked up a pair of these and they're an absolute bargain at only £13 as well. Uh, my daughter picked a pair up and yeah um, I actually really like them. I'm still not 100% that they suit me. I'm not sure if it, they make me look kind of frumpy or I can still pull it off because I don't want to look like I'm trying to dress really young. Um, but you'll see in the clip of me wearing them. So I'd really like to know what you guys think, whether I should keep them, whether they suit me. I'd probably just team them with, you know, like a t-shirt and some trainers or something like that. But you'll see in another clip that I'll put up, my daughter tried them on just with a simple black top and some like high heel sandals and they looked really good. So you could kind of style them up or down. So yeah, um, let me go, let me know what you think because I'm, um, yeah, I'm not 100% sure, but I do really like them and I think for £13 they're an absolute bargain. I also got a pair of black jeans. So these jeans I got are the Super Stretch Skinny. So I got these in a size 12. They are quite tight, but I don't think I'd want the next size up because I think they'd be too big. So I'd probably say they're true to size and they're really stretchy as well. So I really like that when you're getting them on, they're not too difficult. Um, also wanted some black jeans that have belt loops in them. Really impressed with these ones. And again, only £13. Um, my daughter also got some black jeans. These are the Shaping Super High Waist Skinny. These were only £10, which is just crazy for a pair of jeans. So these ones, again, are really tight, skinny jeans. But they've also got a bit of stretch in them. Um, and they come up slightly higher on the waist here. So I've got one more pair of jeans. And... I don't actually know why I picked them up because I don't like them. So I'll show you um, a clip of me wearing them and trying them on. So again, you can let me know what you think. But these are the ankle grazer mid-rise. They've got like this ripped like, hem on them, I suppose, at the bottom. Um, yeah, and I just, I don't know why I bought them because I don't actually like it. And I'm actually really annoyed because the fit of these is actually fantastic. They're really stretchy and they're actually really comfortable. Take them back and see if they've got some kind of plainer styles in there instead. So the next thing I wanted to show you were tops. So I was really excited to get some nice new tops and jumpers because I just love the autumn and getting all cosy. It just, oh, it just makes you feel so nice. So I bought this lovely jumper I'll show you it here. It's a roll neck jumper. It's kind of a, I suppose, a, a camel type colour. And it's got these beautiful, you can see there, these beautiful kind of buttons on the arms. It's, I really, really like it because it fits well. It, this colour, I just love this colour. It goes with so much. Um, it was only £13. I got this one in a small, but the arms, I just I don't know what's wrong with it. it they're so long now I'm not particularly short so I'm um, I'm five foot five so I'm pretty normal height I haven't got particularly short arms but these arms are just so long like ridiculously long which again I'm really gutted about because I really like this jumper um, but I know sometimes with Primark things just 
don't fit properly and you can get the jumper a different jumper the same one but just a different one and it fits completely fine so I'm going to take it back see if they've got any more maybe try a another one on and see if it's the same if it's the style of the jumper or if it's just that particular top next thing I got on jumpers was just one of these just a roll neck so I got just a cream roll neck jumper. I got this in a medium, which is 12 to 14. Um, I always like to size up slightly in these stretchy jumpers because otherwise I find them just a little bit too tight because they're quite clingy anyway. Um, and this was, I think it was six pound, was it? Yeah, six pound that was. Ideal just for wearing with a pair of jeans or something in the winter. I also, also picked one of these up. So hers is slightly different to my one hers is more of a i suppose a turtleneck so mine actually rolled over whereas this one doesn't um same price so a size six and she picked this one up in an extra small which is a size six to eight because she prefers her clothes a little bit clingier than me and she'll generally tuck them in my daughter also bought a couple of hoodie type sweatshirt comfy tops um, she's off to uni in literally two weeks so just wanted some kind of casual things just to throw on when she's going to her lectures it's kind it's not completely cropped but it's a it's a little bit cropped but it looks really nice with high-waisted jeans um, it's got a hood on it um, and then it's just got kind of these tassel bits down here really nice detailing with the zip I just think the colors look really like fashionable as well and then this bit down here so you can just tighten this and kind of hook that up there so it looks really nice but yeah this was only 12 pound and again this was two times extra small so that's a size four to six because this did actually come up quite big so you can see even being in a four to six kind of how big it comes up so yeah it's just really kind of cool and i think it actually looks a lot more expensive than it is as well um another sweater that she bought with this yellow sweater so it's just like a kind of sweatshirt type material um it's got the rounded neck on it again she got it in the two times extra small which is a size four to six because they do come up quite big um which i suppose jumpers are meant to be but she didn't want it kind of too oversized because she is quite petite um but it seems to fit her really well um the color is just fantastic and it was only five pound five pound is an absolute bargain just for something to throw on quickly when she's going into uni i think is just amazing so yeah just this a pair of jeans some trainers fantastic she also got another hoodie so she got this khaki hoodie here so this is slightly different because i don't know if you can see it comes down kind of slightly longer at the back so it's shorter at the front and then longer at the back which i actually quite like but she doesn't like it at all so yeah that is going to be returned this one was slightly more than the yellow one and um, this one was 10 pounds i also got myself a hoodie so i'll show you what i got so i'm not normally a hoodie person don't normally wear hoodies or anything and i seen this and i absolutely loved it so my daughter wanted the whole tracksuit so they do this as a tracksuit where you get this top and then the bottoms as well but unfortunately they didn't have it in her size but they had the top in my size so i thought i would get it um and yeah it's just really nice i think it actually fits quite nice and it's so soft the inside of it is just it feels so nice against your skin um, I got this in a medium, so a size 12 to 14. This one was £12, so a little bit more expensive. But I feel the quality is actually really good. And the last, the last top that I got is just one of these kind of stretchy, slinky type um, material tops. So it's a roll neck. And this was again a medium so size 12 to 14 and was only five pounds so it's in this kind of rust orangey red color which I really like and I think is fabulous for that autumn so what I really like about this is because it's quite thin and not too thick it's ideal when you're in and out of places because I know sometimes if you go shopping you wear a big jumper and then you're absolutely boiling whereas this is ideal to wear under a coat and so if you want to kind of layer up um, yeah really like this and I think you could wear it with a pair of jeans or you know I'd even probably wear this 
to work with a skirt or something. We also got a couple of tops in there, so I'll just show you those quickly. This t-shirt, now I've got another t-shirt like this, I can't remember what it says, and I got that from Primark, and I wasn't sure I'd wear it, but I actually wear it all the time, just with a pair of jeans or like a, um, a denim kind of midi skirt. But this one, it's just a baggy kind of t-shirt like this, and it says on it, you totally can. Now, it, this one's probably a little bit thinner than the one I've got, but it's not too thin, so it's actually quite nice. I just think it's super nice just for those easy days when you want to throw a t-shirt and jeans on. What I really like about it as well is that it's quite long, so you can wear it out kind of over jeans or leggings or whatever, or you can actually tuck it in like I've done in the clip, um, and just wear it with a pair of jeans and a belt and some trainers. Um, and I just think it's a really kind of trendy outfit, so if I'm trendy. <laughs> that was only £5 and in medium again. So the only other two things that I bought are a couple of dresses that I've seen in there. I did actually want some more dresses but there weren't really that many dresses in there that I kind of liked. So I got this dress. This is a shirt dress. I'm so into like shirt midi dresses at the minute. Style's quite flattering. It just buttons up down the front and then at the back it's got this um, kind of bow bit that does up here. Three quarter length sleeves. It's kind of a midi length, so between the knees and the ankles. And I've just teamed it here with a pair of boots, a pair of cream boots. This one was £15, and again, it's a size 12. The last dress that I got was a jumper dress. And again, I'm not 100% I'm not sure on this because I'm not sure if it makes me look a bit fat or yeah i don't know let me know what you guys think in the comments down below so it's basically a roll neck jumper dress um and it was only 13 pounds so i think for a jumper dress that's an absolute bargain um i got it in a size 10 because it looked quite big um and when i try it on it is actually quite big i think if i got a size 12 it would have absolutely drowned me so on this one i'd probably either say stick to your size or size down slightly depending on how you like the fit i would just team this with some black leggings or black tights and boots or something like that um you could even wear a belt round it and maybe some heels to kind of dress it up a little bit more i also picked up a couple of these vest tops so I've got quite a lot of like stringy vest tops, but I haven't actually got any like this. So I quite like these ones. These are slightly thicker straps. And I think when they're a bit thicker like this, actually, they actually look a bit nicer than just the kind of the thin strap ones. And these were, I think they were, how much were they? £2.50, I've got a tag on one of them. Yep, £2.50. So I got these in a size medium, again, because I don't like them too tight, but have got a lot of stretch in them so you probably could get away with them being true to size and again Primark is so weird with their sizing so I bought the grey one in a medium and I bought a white one in a medium and the white one is absolutely massive so I haven't even got a clip of me trying you on because it just looked ridiculous it kind of was all gaping here you can see all of my bra it's just really weird yeah they're both the same size but they fit me so differently. One other thing I wanted to show you really quickly was a skirt that my daughter picked up. So this was a high-waisted skirt um, in a size six, which was, how much was it? It was 13 pounds um, and it is so tiny. Now she's tiny anyway, but she couldn't even get this past her bottom. I might just need to sort their sizes out. They're just so sorry it wasn't even 13 pounds it was eight pounds so absolute bargain but yeah she's always a size six sometimes she's a size four so not to be able to fit in a size six is a bit weird so i, I just wish all their sizes would be the same it's so annoying when you go in you think you pick something up because it's your size and then it just doesn't fit you at all oh so frustrating so that's it in terms of clothing um, and we also got a couple of accessories in there so my daughter picked up this bag so this was eight pound it's got a strap in here as well so you can kind of have it over your shoulder or if you don't want to you can just hold it like so i thought that was actually really cute and lots of looks a lot more expensive than eight pound i seen one very similar in river island for 35 pounds so that is an absolute steal.
Only other things got not very exciting were some of these um, invisible shoe liners um, and only £2.50. A pack of hairbands because don't know where hairbands go. Me and my daughter lose them all the time. And the last thing I got was this toiletry set. It's a three piece set and this was £5 for three of them. So that is everything that I got in the Primark haul. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video and enjoyed seeing what we picked up from Primark. If you have then I'd love for you to give me a thumbs up um, and if you're not already doing so then I'd love for you to subscribe to my channel.